Okay, uh, this app is called Super 3D Alphabet. Let's go ahead and open this up. And uh, we have a few options here. First thing we're going to do is we're going to uh, just mute the music so I can uh, do the demo for you. Uh, we've got Draw the Alphabet, Visual Memory, uh, Puzzle 3D, Acoustic Memory, and Find the Letter. So let's go ahead and look at Draw the Alphabet. And what you'll find is that you have uh, 26 letters, and as you complete a letter, you unlock another one. So, for example, you would start with the letter A, and you would follow uh, the numbers. And then once you complete that, you get a check mark. You can undo the drawing at any time, if you did it wrong, or the wrong way around. If you're too far off the line it'll tell you to do it again. So obviously you can't go too far outside the lines. It's nice because it lets you uh, be very freehand. So it, it's, uh, it, it gives you the opportunity to, to really draw and not make it uh, go where it's supposed to go in order to get it right. Once you complete the letter you can open another letter so we've got all the way to E we haven't completed that yet and you would just come on here and you'll see I'm a little off but try it again see if we can get it right and there you go so you do have to be pretty accurate uh, going back out you'll see that now F is open. So that's how that works. Let's go back out to the main page and let's have a look at uh, visual memory. So this is kind of like the regular memory game uh, where you have a bunch of squares. You've got different size. Let's open up on the stars and I'll just show you very quickly. Um, and this is the J C F H H H. And you go through that and you match them until you complete that. So that's level one. I'll show you the other two levels. Uh, let's have a look at level two. Obviously more squares, a little bit harder. B, J, H, N, L. And so on. And then I'll show you the final level on there, which is uh, the most squares. There's quite a lot of squares on there. So um, that's quite tough. I've tried that one myself. Um, going back out. Let's go back out to the main page and let's look at the um, 3D puzzle or puzzle 3D. And again you have uh, the letters that you've uncovered so we're on F. Let's go ahead and open up F. And this mixes them up. Uh, they've got some other apps that are like this but if you press up and down on the right you can rotate this and you can rotate it left and right. And obviously the idea is to match up the colors like that to form the correct letter. F. And then once you've done that you can play with it and rotate it around. So it's very neat, very neat to play with, very nicely done and really cool to look at actually. Um, my kids like to look at it. Good for fine motor skills. Uh, you can pinch and uh, spread your fingers to zoom in and zoom out which is nice. We'll go back out. That's just a quick sample of the puzzles. And then you can see that G is now open. So let's see what else we've got. Going back to the acoustic memory. Now this is uh, a little bit harder than the visual memory because you're going based on just sounds. So I'll show you. It's the same amount of squares as on the other one. But instead of it showing you a letter, it's just going to tell you the letter for that square and you have to remember. So here, I'll just show you a demonstration. E. B. I. F, C, A, G, I. So you'd have E, H. Let's see if I, I get these two. I. So those two would be I. But as you can tell from that demonstration, it's just auditory and it's not visual. Um, so you have to visually remember where you heard the sound. Is what I'm trying to tell you. So it's it's a lot more. Um, it's a lot harder. Uh, but it's definitely challenging, and of course, as you go through those levels, uh, it becomes quite uh, quite challenging when you have all of those squares on there. 
uh, going on to the final level just to show you it's the same okay we'll come back out let's go back to the main menu and have a look at the last thing we've got on here and this is find the letters F Q V so this is sort of a, a memory as well as visual. It's asked you to find F, Q, and V. You have one out of ten, so you're going to have to do this ten times. Uh, if you press the F sound Q again, it'll tell you. V. And you have to get them in order. F, Q, V, D, B, A, D, B, A, R, V, L. If you get it wrong. S. T. And even if you get L. the right letter, but it's not in the correct order, it won't go up into the space. So L is the third letter, but if L. I try to do it now, it won't let me do that. And I've already forgotten what the letters are. So let me R press V L R V L. So you get the idea. W. And this is number C four of ten. I. So you get the idea there. We'll head back out. And um, lots and lots of fun things to do on there. Can turn the music back on and that's a demonstration of super 3d alphabet